What's up, sweetheart? I mean, this can, this can. Whoa. He's over. Yeah. That's 2,000 pounds. One, two, three. <sighs> Man, all we need is some dynamite. Yeah. So what have we done? Let me see the whole thing. Caution. Drive shaft may be damaged. You got any of bolt you want to put in? If you want to run it, we can run it or just keep going, but it looks fun up here too. Welcome to the beaten trail and this is trail 92. We'll be going up this double diamond at Ivy Branch. We were running a couple different trails while we were out here and we found all bunch of different riverbeds that were all labeled trails and this happened just before we got up there what's up sweetheart i mean this can this can oh he's over yeah you're right josh had backed what into happened? A little bit of the edge of the rock that just popped them over. What'd you hit? This rock? No, my back tire must went up that bank. Alright. I see it's not black. Hey, look here, see how heavy it is. That's two thousand pounds. Yeah, and you still have to get over your tires. I'm kinda of thinking almost but not quite. Is it, yeah, is it just gonna hit the bank and right, it'll lay flat and then we can move? Where it. should I be? We just got a lift, but we're gonna need more than just four of us. I oh, can't really get the frame that well. We probably can't get it. <laughs> I don't. I don't think we Too can. Bad we don't have an adrenaline going right now. Oh, yeah, it's f***ing heavy. We got. It. <sighs> yeah. All right. I'll just go forward. You want to just put it in neutral from here and put yeah, you push it? Reach. Go ahead. Forward. Go ahead. Or you stay there. Just don't get crushed. If it starts to roll over, just get out of the way. I could winch forward too if I have to. Yeah. If somebody could just here, one, on that side. two, three. Almost. One, two, three. <sighs> It might be all right. In the back. It, it's good. I think it's good. I don't think it's just fall. just be careful for it to fall. Yeah. That's all. Once Josh is on that side, I don't know. All right. You cheated death once again, man. <laughs> so other than a mirror, Josh did have more damage, and he made his way back up onto the trail. We eventually settled back into Trail 92 after lunch to go up and see what we could find and Shane was in the lead. We'll see how far we can get up, really, and if we were going to go all the way up or not. And this is up 92, which is a, one of those fun double diamonds, but we will see how far we get. And once we got to this part, I realized this was going to be where the challenge was really going to be. And I can see the size of those rocks even from here. So we just watch Shane and see how far he could get.
we needed some dynamite. Yeah. Because that's what usually happens to me. I go around a rock and then I fall back down into it. Oh, you got one? Is that what the red means? You're getting closer to the... Still might need a shackle. No shackles. Huh. Is this how they did it, like here? Up this? You gonna pull that tree down? It looks like it's gonna fall, right? This one here. Yeah. I don't know how much more cable I got, but I think it's only 50 foot. Alright, I'm done pulling. I would almost rather have another machine. You got enough strap there, Rachel. Yeah, just strap it on, on that on the tree.
need somebody to push? From the side? What? You need somebody to push your side? I'm not volunteering myself, but you know. If he could hold his nose down. So back, yeah, back left 100%. Oh, yeah, it's it's so all the way is sitting on that back tire. Yeah. Is that car spinning? This one is, yeah. I don't know what's beyond that either, so. Hey Josh, there's no way to come back down the other way. Does it look just as bad? Yeah, <laughs> can't imagine it gets any better. Because the right one was spinning, the left. Right one was? Yeah, right one was spinning, the left one totally like not. See how it's angled down in here? Oh, it popped out maybe? Or broke and then jammed? Yeah. I think it's broken there like the Super ATV did. Because it got bound up. Actually, All was, the yeah. weight was on that. I was waiting for the tire to pop off the It was right, right in that, right in that, <coughs> that hole. <laughs> but I do believe I have our first. Um, 
You gonna do it, Josh? Yeah, I my low gear doesn't have the torque for that. Did you guys get any pictures? Did yeah. You? Oh. So if you want to do it, I'll, you know, I gotta, you can just move my Honda out of the way. Okay. Like up to the left and then you go to the right, I'll stay here and film. Any last words? Fingers crossed. You'll make it. I might make it, but I'm probably gonna break something too. Nah, gotta be more positive. You'll, like, you'll only break one axle. Just tell me out of here when I break my differential. <laughs> and then the right rock, the right tires should be on those boulders picking up. Josh wrecks the Honda. <laughs> Yeah, it was only like a foot drop though, right? <laughs> yeah. I mean, you could probably drag me up, but I'd be scraping the shit of everything. Yeah. And then it was Josh's turn. We had a lot of confidence he was going to be able to do it in those 35s. Show off. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Show off. <laughs> yeah, we'll take the 35s off of your tire. Well, congratulations. You're now official uh, king of the valley. Record time. You did it in like 23 seconds, and that was it. <laughs> Uh, the Honda will not be doing that today. But, a lot of fun. Plenty of space, Josh, just to go take the right lane. Okay. You guys want us to hang with you? Um, if you want to head back, I think... I mean, are you gonna... Is there photo-worthy up there? No, not really. Hey, uh... Yeah, they have to do just talking a lot. You threw it! You threw an axle! You threw an axle!
So further up, the trail would continue, and we would just go meet them at the end. We didn't know what kind of waterfall or rock climb there were ahead, but it surely was going to be entertaining for this next part. Yeah, I could kind of just turn. There shouldn't be an issue. And then I'll follow you up. Sorry, Honda, not this time. Not this time. Shane, can you hear me? No, can you hear me with my voice? I'm gonna try to walk down. Be there in a minute. I'm walking down the hill. <clears throat> There's just not too many little trees that'll give their lives for me. Anybody a radio down here? No. Um, no. Or do you need to run and start? That's slippery. Yeah, be careful. Do you want me to back up? If I roll, I'm gonna hit your machine. I don't care. I'd rather catch you. Keep you from going all the way over, maybe. 
It's already broken 10 places. Well, Let me get behind it. you and up there. Be careful. Slippery fuck. You think you can or can't? I said, I don't know how I walked up there. It's a good thing you have front, front axles. They'll pull you out, yeah, baby. Something will work. <clears throat> you can just sit down and slide the waterfall down. You might not have a choice. I had a lot of grip, just so you know. This trail was bad the whole way. She only got stuck once. It was still challenging. Oh yeah. Yeah. Imagine if it was a full yeah, rainstorm. Yeah. Imagine if a full rainstorm. <laughs> that was a fun ass trail. Not for shame. He has one wheel drive now. Super ATV. That was your drive shaft, right? Yep. Not very cheap. At least something else is broke. There's a whole bunch of parts just laying on the ground. That sucks. What? Was a... Are you being serious? No, Shane. Everything looks fine from up here. This broke her shaft because it beat me in the leg. Only a little bit. I'm gonna back up to this to my That was slick. Good. And with Shane finally hooked up and over the waterfall, Josh towed him out.
Josh just making sure that Shane was going to clear the obstacles. There was a lot of down branches that were getting caught up in the Can-Am. down in the valley we didn't have much cell service but we were going to try to google where Shane could get parts either that night or the next day dealer right up the street yeah but they probably close at five it's like 4 40. yeah i mean we're not going to get out of here i got it you got it out yep um what do you want me to google find a can-am dealer nearest can-am dealer can-am dealer julian west virginia What you got, brother? Michael. Carnage. Yeah, let me see the carnage. Oh my god. But I've seen that on. Yep, up, 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 up. So, what have we done? Let me see the whole thing. Nice and twisty and bendy. Yep. That's uh, trail 94. I don't know what that says 82 92 92 most difficult caution drive shaft may be damaged you got any other bolts you want to put in here there we go you got any more bolts you want to put in here uh no because the one bolt's in here in the yep nut. that's it okay. so technically if i could find a shop cut it and weld it cut it and weld it 120 dom because it's still good there's nothing. And now with minimal drive, maybe one wheel drive, Shane needed a little assistance from Josh to get him up some of the hills. Shane just need a little pull on that one. Shane is working one or two wheel drive. Drive shaft shot. As you saw before, we're now here at trail 50, making a left headed back to Julian. Oh, hey, I toot it. Tooted. All right, you're unhooked. Yep. All right, 50 to 49 to 10. Get it on video? Yeah. I love pulling the KMs out of trails. That's right. Did that the first time. Nope. Won't be the last. Nope. Broken dip at all. A quick shout out to our partners and sponsors. Thank you for being on board. We appreciate having you along for the ride. Be sure to pick up some hats and shirts and so much more on the Beaten Trail Apparel page. Thanks for watching, and we'll have more wow. Ivy Branch videos coming soon. Until then, we'll see you out there on the trail. Thanks. Josh backed over him. Drive shaft is yeah. good. It, it twisted the whole shaft and pulled it off. So the drive shaft is.